Welcome to our second tutorial about the bend tool. In this tutorial, we're going to learn about bend relief and bend remnants. Let's begin with a flange on my primary plate. I'll select this edge, expand the dialog window, select Width, and click OK. Here we'll be looking at the bend radius, the bend relief, the bend depth, and the bend remnants. Let's double click on the flange. First, let's check out bend radius. In the value field, we also see bend radius. Let's click OK and go to the Manage tab. Now click Parameters. The first parameter is the thickness of the sheet metal, half a millimeter. Let's take a look at the bend radius parameter. It's equal to the thickness. Bend relief width is also equal to the thickness. The bend relief depth is set to half of the thickness. Minimum remnant is twice the thickness. Let's click Done. And now let's see how we can set all this up. First, let's go to Sheet Metal Rules. Select Default Millimeters. Now to the Bend tab. Here's the bend radius setting. We've set it to thickness in this window. If I mouse over, I see that the value is half a millimeter. When I mouse over the other fields, I also see their corresponding values. Now let's talk about the relief shape. The default bend relief shape is straight. Our other options are tier or round. The relief width equals the thickness, as you see here. The relief depth equals half the thickness. The minimum remnant is twice the thickness. Let's click Done. Now let's double click on flange 1. We'll change the bend radius to two times the thickness. Thickness, and let's enter our formula, asterisk 2. Let's go to the bend tab. We'll change the bend relief shape to round. The default is currently set to straight. And click OK. Now let's double click on the flange again. Let's see how the remnant options work now. Offset and select our corner. And let's select List Parameters. The thickness multiplied by 3.1. And click OK. Let's go to the Tools tab now. Activate the Distance tool. Let's measure our remnant. You see that the length of the remnant is just a little more than twice the thickness. Let's measure the relief value now. The relief is the width. The relief is the width times the thickness. The total distance is 3.1 times the thickness. Let's edit the flange again. Let's change this value 3.1. Let's use 2.5 instead. And click OK. You see that since the remnant is less than twice the thickness value, it's automatically removed. Let's check out the third relief shape now. Tier. Select that from the drop down menu and click OK. And this is what a tier relief looks like. Let's go back to the Manage tab, Styles Editor. And let's go to the Bend tab. Let's change the default bend relief to round, for example. Save and done. Now let's double click on flange 1. And as you see in our drop down menu here, the default shape shows as round. This concludes our tutorial about bend relief and minimum remnants.